welcome to another edition of the Sunday Sunshine Show. Um, it's four YouTubers that get together every Sunday morning. We call ourselves the Transatlantic Housewives. There's uh, Busy Bee Marie, who lives in Las Vegas, uh, Maria Crocker and Karen from Geordie Grandma. Uh, we've been collaborating for about a year now and we come on every Sunday morning at half past seven and do what we call the Sunday Sunshine Show. Um, I'm sorry if this is boring if you've heard it before, but if you're a new viewer, um, you won't know what's going on. <laughs> so uh, what it is, we all do... Um, a similar topic sometimes i get it wrong like last week <laughs> but uh put our own slant on it and this week what we're doing is decorating the christmas tree um and just talking about christmas whilst we're decorating now I, i've showed you before i've just done um i've put like the basics on my tree um but what i'm going to do is i'm going to go through in these boxes here are all the decorations that are like my special decorations that I love. So I'm going to get them out. Some of them might not be for the tree. I've not looked at them. So I'll just go through them. So this is a Christmas scene. Um, I think it lights up. Now, but I got this last year from the charity shop. I have a feeling the light up doesn't work on it. It looks like it's glued in, can you see? But I still like it. That looks like it could do with gluing on. But I got that last year from the charity shop. It was a nice find. So I'll put that somewhere. I'm not sure. I'm just coming to these as I get to them. Oh, this is just a couple of gingerbread Christmas plates that I got from Asda a couple of years ago. Um, I'm going to do a Christmas Eve um, open house. So I'll probably put some mince pies or something on there. Probably something a bit more adventurous than mince pies. Right, so that's the first box. Now I'm not sure, um, I do have a lot of, uh, I've collected over the years, Fat Fairy, are they in here? No. Oh, this is an item I got from TK Maxx quite a number of years ago. And it, it's a light up, it's probably, oh, a light up glass Christmas tree. Isn't that lovely? That'll be going in my dining, in my other room. Have I got anything? Oh, there's just that in that box. I'm not doing very well here. I've got a couple more boxes over there. I'm looking for my fat fairies. Oh, now, what have I got in here? A, a couple of lovely penguins. My daughter bought me these. I think they were from Next. Um, aren't they gorgeous? I love them. There was a great big one, but we couldn't get that. And then there is another one here that isn't from Next, um, but I bought it to match. So they'll go on my fireplace. My three penguins. So I'll put those on my fireplace. Now it's the start of my fat fairies. Now I do put these on the Christmas tree. I love these. Um, I've, I've bought a couple myself and then I've had the rest bought as gifts over the years because people know I like them. Uh, and there's a particular shop in Polton called Best Friends and he sells these um, amongst lots of other lovely things. So I think this is a blueberry fairy. So she'll be going on the tree. And then I've got another one. I'm not as fond of her, but she will be going on the tree as well. We all will be going on the tree. I'm not sure how many I've got in here. I have got quite a few, because I've had quite a few bought as gifts over the years. There's another one. It's time for the fat fairies to come out. Have we got another? What's this? Oh yes, another one. Friends have bought them as Christmas presents over the years, because they know I like them. Thank you, Mary Ann. Mary Ann bought me a lovely one. I think this was the one that I got last year. Lovely, aren't they? They're unusual, aren't they? So these will all be going on my Christmas tree. I think this one next is my favourite.
I think she'll be beautiful. Right, so those are my set fairies, no more. No, and I'll get the um, penguins out. On to the next box. Just bear with me while I get my next box out. You can tell I love Christmas and everyone knows that I do. Oh, now I'll tell you what this is. My husband, you, he bought this. He loved it. It's a smoking man. You put like, um, can't remember where you put it now. Does the top, oh, that's it, yeah. You put like a, a smoker thing there and then it gives out fragrance and uh, the smoke comes out of his mouth. That was my husband, he loved that. And then what have I got here? Oh, a Santa Christmas bubble with a mask on. I don't think we'll bother with that one this year. I think I was a bit fed up in lockdown and I bought that. And then another glass Santa. I don't have many glass ones on the tree. I did like that one though, so that might go on. It's very retro, isn't it? I'm not having the one with the mask on. We don't want to be reminded of that, do we? Right, what have we got in here? Oh, these are just candlesticks. I probably won't even bother putting those out. I think I got them from Primark. They're just glass candlesticks. They can go back upstairs. And then what's in here? Oh, this. Now, isn't that lovely? I got that from the charity shop last year. I just saw it in the window and I thought, oh, I love that. I don't know. I paid four pounds from it. I can't read who it, it is, what make it is. But I just thought that was so lovely. And then this is a lovely bauble. So that'll be going on the tree. And then... This is another one that I've wrapped set. I think I must have bought this late on because it doesn't look like it's ever been on the tree. I maybe bought it in the sale, you know, so. So, oh, I've one more. Oh yes, this is a lovely one. It, it, this is glass. So I'll put these on the tree now. I love decorating the Christmas tree. Always gives me a bad back though. Um, it's amazing, isn't it, um, how different you, your house looks. And also, when you take them down, you think, oh my goodness, it looks so clean, doesn't it, after, when you take them down. You should see the tip in this room, but I'm hoping to get it sorted today. So um, I am going to my daughter's for dinner. So that's one thing, I don't have to make the dinner. Right, let's put the things on the tree. Normally, I would have a glass of sherry or something but it's in the day I often used to do it in the evening uh, obviously you have to when you're working uh, and I also would have Christmas music on but obviously we can't have Christmas music and I get mixed up with my music when I add it don't I make a mess of it <laughs> all the time I say I'm going to edit on my um, laptop and I always do it on my phone because I don't know what I'm doing with my laptop and I keep saying to Busy B Marie and the other girls, oh, I'm definitely going to edit this week on my laptop, and then I never do. But I must really try. Right, let's put some things on the tree. Right, I've been chatting to you for about 10 minutes and putting the flower fairies on the tree, the fat fairies, and I hadn't switched the camera on. Aren't I an idiot? So I've put Santa on up here. I've put this fairy on. I've put this on and another fairy round here. Right, let's put one here. She's weighing the branch down a bit, but see if I put her further in. Yeah, I don't think you can see her. Right, I've just got three more to put on. The strings come off one, so I'll have to do a bit of uh, jiggery pokery with it. Right, 
Right, I'm going to put a few more bits on the tree and then I'll get back to you and show you the completed tree. Thank you. 